Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Alhamdulillah rabbil alamin. Wassalatu wassalamu ala asrabil anbiya wal mursalin wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajmain. Amma ba'd. So this will be the third video of the day and then the third video of the day here I am dedicating this video for class of 2017. Yeah, today I got several uh texts yeah and then i got several message also that asking sir when we are going to get our thesis advisor and then what about the process or the procedure we are going to conduct before we are going to get the thesis advisor yeah so for those that asking about the thesis advisor uh, I hope you guys will be uh, will be really patient, yeah, because uh, I'm still thinking about uh, making the schedule for the comprehensive exam, and then after that one, uh, delivering some of the lecture to be the thesis advisor, and then working on the last report for the freedom of learn and make our curriculum. And then I have to uh, become the session chair on one of the international event also from APCOR, yeah. And then uh, I have many things, yeah. I have many things to deal with. So uh, maybe, uh, inshallah, and this week I'll try to uh, decide, I'll try to choose each of your guys uh, thesis advisor and then please kindly be patient because uh, I have to decide here which one come first and then which, which one that I have to do first and then uh, putting or deciding which one being the thesis advisor here is not as easy as you guys think yeah I need to ask the lecturer first and then I need to uh, read about the proposal first. I need to understand about your guys' content first, and then after that one, uh, and then I need to make it relevant with the lecturer that you are going to uh, be advised with. Yeah, so it is not only okay deciding this one with this lecture. No, it is not as simple as you guys think. Yeah, that's why I need some. Uh, I need some or more times yeah, to uh, decide or to divide each of you guys this is advisor but inshallah one more time if I can make it this week inshallah I'll try to uh, deliver I'll try to distribute all of the thesis advisor for you guys yeah and because of that one because of that one uh, this week inshallah will be the deadline for you guys to get the thesis advisor and then after that one also some of class of 2016 yeah class of 2016 already asked me about their uh, step after completing the thesis yeah after, after getting their uh, thesis approval from their advisor yeah so next step guys you have to uh make or you have to fill all the requirement before you're going to be eligible to register for thesis exam and then i guess when i discuss about thesis requirement you can try to browse the previous video when i discuss about what what are the requirement that you have to fulfill so before you're going to be eligible in registering your thesis exam yeah, so it is not completing your thesis and then uh, registering the thesis. No, but you have to you have to uh, fulfill several kind of requirement first. Yeah, so you have to make sure you have a full certificate. You have a tuple score, and then you also already publish your article in a several kind of journal. Yeah, and then after that one, you have to uh, match with uh the what is it you have to match with the policy from our faculty yeah and then since you guys from 
2016. So you guys still using uh, an old kind of rule. So you're going to uh, give me your uh, proof that you already watch uh, test is exam 10 times. Yeah, it's, it will be different with class of 2017. For class of 2017, you guys, you don't have to make it in a print out kind of uh, paper or letter when you guys already got your test as advisor, but it's fully online. Uh, you can use the eCampus to uh, propose or to make uh, your request to get the test as advisor. Yeah, I guess that's all for the third video of the day. Thank you very much guys for watching and then for class of 2017 and then also for class of 2016. I hope you guys will uh, try to be more focused, try to be patient yeah, in conducting, in completing and finishing your tests so you may graduate sooner. Yeah, that's all I guess. And then stay being an awesome student. And then the last, I say, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Peace out.